<lacht> der gute alte Rumpfetten Nebel. <lacht> oh man, ich glaube, der Name ist gefühlt einfach nur so ein Joke gewesen. Ne? Oh, mal gucken, wem es ein, wem's auffällt. <lacht> Rumpfetten Nebel. Oh man, sind die ganzen Planeten da Ersche oder was? Da gehen wir auch noch hin. Da wundert mich nicht, dass Jacob da eigentlich hin will. Ne? Sightseeing. Der guckt sich dann jeden, jeden Planeten dann besonders gut an. Aber wir gehen jetzt dahin, wo es am meisten was zu tun gibt, zum Halbmondnebel. Da existieren nur halbe Monde. Da sind alle Monde in zwei Hälften gebrochen und jetzt sind sie nur noch halb. Nicht mehr ganz. Ilium. Miranda helfen. Liara. Just die Karin. Landen. Jack mit. Mich Gareth mit? Wollen? Jack Gareth mit. Da also hat sich jetzt bei denen nichts getan. Enden. Wahrscheinlich in der Makropolenwelt. Ja, also. Ah, nein! Towers of Asari Grace, ne? Aber es ist wahrscheinlich eine Makropole. Welcome to Nosastra, Commander Shepard. We've been instructed to waive all docking and administration fees for your visit. My name is Karina. If you need information about the area, it would be my pleasure to assist you. Warum kriege ich alles gratis? Who instructed you to waive the fees? The order came from Liara Tassoni, who paid all fees on your behalf. She also asked that I direct you to speak with her at your convenience. She's near the trading floor. Okay. You said Liara was here? What's she doing? Liara is one of Nosastra's most respected information brokers. Nosastra is based upon trade. Information is valuable currency and Liara has done quite well. As I said, you'll find her near the trading floor. She was looking forward to seeing you. Okay. Thank you. Again, welcome to our city, Commander. Please enjoy your stay. Customs records indicated just a car named Samara is visiting this port, Shepard. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. You may wish to speak with her regarding the whereabouts of Thane Krios, the assassin on your dossier, as well. Twenty-five. Sell at twenty-five. No, no, no. You're not hearing me. I want to buy it up. Buy it all up. Come on, come on. Give me something. Excuse me. Excuse me, or you command... You're Commander Shepard? I saw your... I guess you would say your aura. I'd recognize you anywhere. I was asked to give you a message if I saw you. It's from a friend you made on Novaria. Um, okay. What message were you asked to give? Shepard, we hide. We borrow. We build. But we know that you seek those who soured the songs of our mothers. When the time comes, our voice will join with yours. And our crescendo will burn the darkness clean. Thank you, Shepard. The Rachni will sing again because of you. I'm glad to hear that you're rebuilding. Are you somewhere close by? The Rachni Queen is not here. That message is one of many memories I carry from her. I encountered her on an uncharted world. She saved my life. More than that, she gave me a purpose. They are an amazing people, Shepard. The galaxy owes you a great debt for giving them a second chance. Okay. Uh... How did you find the Rachni? I was working as a courier. Pirates ambushed my ship, and I was forced down on an uncharted planet. I was badly injured, alone and near death. Then they found me. They saved me. The Piraten? 
What happened to the pirates who attacked you? They were obliterated, as they should have been. The Rachni are not aggressive, but they do what they must. Okay, verständlich. Wo sind sie? I got that she was grateful. But what else was her message saying? That the first Rachni war was a mistake. Something soured the voices of her people. In Rachni psychology, that would be like mind control, I think. It doesn't really translate. Anyway, she believes you are fighting the ones who did that, and she promises to help. She thinks that the Reapers caused the Rachni war? I can't say for sure, but she was certain that her ancestors were forced into war against their will. Her people aren't naturally aggressive. If they made war, it was not of their own doing. Can you tell me where the Rachni are? I'm afraid not. I don't even have that information myself any longer. After I met the Rachni Queen, that information was removed. It's not painful, but I simply don't remember. I'll remember when I need to, and her caution is understandable. The galaxy isn't yet ready for the return of the Rachni. Okay. You said the Queen gave you a purpose. What do you mean? The Queen shared her song with me as I recovered. I saw the Rachni as only an Asari could. They are so beautiful and so vulnerable. They needed someone to purchase things they cannot make themselves. Someone to work within the system. An agent, if you will. I am happy to help. My life as a courier was empty and shallow. Now I'm helping a great race rebuild itself. Thank you for giving me that information. I'm glad my friend Anaveria is doing well. Be well, Commander Shepard. You will not see me again. Oh, sie werden mich nicht wieder Okay. Gut, die hat wahrscheinlich wichtigeres zu tun, als es immer äh uh, hallo oh, it is Shepard. The news said you were dead. What happened? No, wait, probably classified. Forget I asked. You just have to lie. It's been a couple of years. I'm Gianna Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. You helped me nail Administrator Analeas. Happy to help. What happened to Administrator Analeas? He made the one mistake Novaria won't tolerate. He got caught taking their money. He's doing a few years in white collar prison. More importantly, he won't work in the field. White again. collar Sit down. prison. If I remember right, I owe you a beer. What brings you to Ilium? You know, that you can talk about. Nothing I can talk about. No offense, but Novaria was dealing with the enemy last time. Damn, you're a hard ass. I'd forgotten that. Hey, listen, I just remembered something. I've got to go. Talk to you later. And don't okay. forget to drink your beer. Oh, weird. Aber das Glas ist leer. Shepard musste weg. Sie hat mich gesehen, durfte Zahlung nicht aufgeben. Man sagt, ich hätte eigentlich schon Pläne von Noveria. Können Sie Ihnen etwas Besonderes zeigen? Okay. Ich würde eh handeln. Welcome. Also. You look like someone who needs high quality equipment. Feel free to look around. My store has the best tech and biotic equipment on Ilium. How do I know this stuff is any good? You're an Asari. Maybe your stuff is no good for humans. I carry nothing but the best. I offer a money-back guarantee. That doesn't oh. help me when I'm dead due to equipment failure. Look, I'm dropping too many credits to screw around here. Well, perhaps I could give you a preferred rate at the kiosk. Here, a small discount. And when I get special items in, you can take a look. What kind of special items are we talking about? Oh, you know, schematics, designs, nothing illegal, but I may not have all the licenses to sell them. Do you have anything else? Anything not listed on your main merchandise kiosk? Well, there is one thing. Very advanced design. Not publicly available yet. That's because it's still in development on Novaria and illegal for export. Hello, Hermia. Parasini, you set me up. But this isn't Novaria. You don't have the authority to arrest me. I don't care whether you go to jail. 
I've got all the evidence I need to find you out of business. Is that everything you needed? Everything and more. You're a lifesaver, Shepard. I, I need to go. I have to talk to my lawyer. Talk fast, Hermia. When the fines hit, you won't be able to afford him. Ah, oh, that was good. I've got to go file a few papers. Come by my table when you've got a minute. Okay. Idiotischer Schaden. I need minimal heat increase and speed. I have extremely high performance requirements. Certainly, sir. Safe, too. I need a 100% safety guarantee of anything going ah. on to my suit. Ah. Oh, the hülle. Auf ich mir. Oha, kauf ich mir. Oha, kauf ich mir. Oha, kauf ich mir. Den kauf ich mir, glaube ich, mal nicht. Kopfschuss Schaden um 5. Ah, oh, weil doch, ich hole mir schon. Er ist, er ist gut. Teuer. Teuer. Hermia is going to be a very poor woman very shortly. Thanks for the help, Shepard. I love nailing Asari. So ageless and superior. Then you get them and they squeal like schoolgirls. So do I actually get to talk to you this time? Or do I need to help you do your job again? Hey, come on, Shepard. Wasn't it at least a little fun? I do the groundwork, you swoop in and get the mark talking. Hell, at least this time I didn't have to wear heels and a dress. It's been a pleasure, Gianna. You too, Shepard. See you around. Oh, hell with it. Mwah. <laughs> Much better than an autograph. <laughs> okay. Take care of yourself, Shepard. You kissed him with a helm. Oh, hey, I was picking a jack right now. Lots of money here. Soft people who make good victims. They're not soft, just unconcerned. They only flaunt what they can afford to lose. Okay. That's kind of rapid transpo uh, transport. Listen, I know the data is vital to the Kurosa family. Asana Dantius didn't give us time to pack. I'm lucky I got out at all. Her mercenaries were starting to shoot. If she lets us back in, I'll get it, I promise. If not, well, we'll just have to hope. Excuse me, I'm on an important call. Okay, I thought I was going to talk to Sorry, I'm busy right now. Okay, okay. Seien Sie doch bitte nicht so. Trust me, the goods coming in from the terminus systems are great for business. Um. Erinnerungen an Ilian. I don't know. Some of them seem dangerous. That's the whole point. Danger. You're sure gateway weapons and armor are good enough for Eclipse? Yeah, I've got a friend in Eclipse. The store's over there. And don't get cute. The whole place is monitored. Oh, Blue Rose. Oh. What do you want? <sighs> Sorry. Sorry, that damn Krogan's love poems are getting on my nerves. The Krogan is reading those love poems to get your attention? His name is Char. We're kind of dating, but, well, 
We're on a break. And he's trying to show me how sensitive he is by, well, wooing me. It's really bad. Why are the two of you on a break? He's serious. Serious, as in talking about kids. Char is a great guy to date, but for something permanent... Krogans live long lives. It's not like dating a human where you just stick it out for a century till they die. Uh, no offense. <laughs> it made me wonder if he really likes me. Or if he just wants kids. He can't have them any other way, you know. Because of the genophage. That sounds like a question you should ask him. I did. I don't think he realized that our kids would always have been a sorry. Non Asari don't always get that we're not taking alien DNA, we're just using it to randomize some of the genetic information. Anyway, Char was quiet for a long time. Then he said that he'd love our girls no matter what color they were. You need to talk to your boyfriend. He's just gonna keep shouting poetry until you do. I know, but it's tough. I like him a lot. Hell, I love him. But I don't know if he's permanent bond material. Wow. Listen, he's a Krogan. Any talk about kids is gonna mess him up. I know. You can't talk to Krogan about the genophage. I get so angry. If you settle down with him, you'll spend the rest of your life wondering if he was after you or kids. Yeah, you're right. I guess I needed to hear somebody else say it. I'm going to talk to him. Here, I've given you a discount at the terminal. Thanks for the help. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Oh, this is the. Oh, Paddlefische. Allianz Kreuzer, Frachter von. Atabasca Klasse, okay. What about you? Going to try and make it as a commando? Why not? Every Asari has biotics. Might as well use them, right? Damn, that's Stabbing a hell of a sniper stuff, rifle. Uh, oh, holy shit. Ich nehme das nicht zum Gewehrschaden. Ich will das Er hat 30% Gesundheit. Okay. Okay. Wenn ich das Geld habe, wenn ich das Geld habe, dann. For example, you know that new drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? That's horrible. There's a 12-page contract for shipping, then a waiver for years. This one has forgotten whether its heat sink is over Hmm. Eternity bar. Da wollen wir hin. Gott, das sind okay. Do you have anything flashier? I want something that says the stars, your skin looks amazing. You're not using biotics to touch things up, are you? I own you. I'm gonna have that asshole arrested. Watch yourself if you go in there. Some human is causing trouble. He's demanding that I sign the place over to him. Is there anything I can do? Oh no, that crap might fly on Omega, but this is Ilium. I'm hooking up security cams now. If he or anybody else causes trouble, I'll have their asses arrested. Yeah. I still don't see why we're here. Solarians do not get married. My family simply negotiated a reproduction contract. Whatever. It's the closest you guys get to a wedding. And that means you get a bachelor party. End of story. I don't understand. Humans celebrate wedding contracts by tempting infidelity? That makes no sense. Calm down, man. Don't embarrass me in front of the stripper. What do Turians do? Do Turians do this too? I'm just here for the drinks. You said that bachelor parties are for very close friends. We're just co-workers. We've been co-workers for five years, though. Aren't Solarian years like dog years? Okay, now that's offensive. I appreciate the gesture, but my people don't even have sex drives the way humans do. Uh-huh. Take a look at that, man. Everybody likes the Asari. Everybody. But we actually reproduce by... I'm 
word. She is very limber. I can appreciate her dancing in an aesthetic manner, but I don't have feelings of... She is a lovely shade of blue. Okay, that makes my legs hurt just watching it. And my knees are meant to bend that way. This isn't as bad as I feared. It's actually... Is it warm in here? Okay, you see that bit there? A little divot in your abdomen? It's called a belly button. The humans in Asari have them, and you're gonna be doing shots out of it later tonight. That oh, God. Sanitary. Not the point, man. I can understand why I might find Asari attractive, but how can they be attractive to humans, too? They look just like Salarians. What? They look exactly like us. I'm, I, I'm not seeing the Salarian thing at all. At all. You're both wrong. Asari look just like Blue Turians. Look at the head fringe. Wait, you don't think they're like mind controlling us to see them as attractive, do you? Please be quiet. You're going to ruin Asari for me. And there aren't many Turian women on Ilium. Well, I suppose watching just one more dance wouldn't hurt. <laughs> That's the spirit. As long as I'm not paying for the drinks. <laughs> I still don't see why we're here. Salarians do not get married. Okay, thank you for coming out. Simply negotiated a reproduction. You're really holding out on me? Conrad, I'm a man on the yeah. edge. You want to see how far I'll go? I learned how to shove a gun in people's faces from Commander Shepard. Hey, if you know this idiot, can you rein him in before I slap his ass with a singularity? Shepard, is it really you? It's me, Conrad Werner. We met on the Citadel. I wanted to become a Spectre. Oh, uh, and then you shoved a gun in my face. You showed me what it meant to be truly extreme. I is that also an N7? So you're alive, huh? I hear it goes like that in the biz. Why don't you sit back and watch how it's done? I got some asses to kick. <laughs> Conrad, let me make this perfectly clear. This is not acceptable. Oh, my foot! You shot my foot! <laughs> that shot barely grazed you, you big baby. Also, ich glaube nicht, dass er ein N7 ist. It still scared me. I knew it the badass mercenary thing. People don't usually shoot me. How did you get that arm? Oh, they make some pretty convincing replicas these days, if you're willing to pay. Getting the whole getup was pretty expensive, but my wife was really supportive. She even paid for my shuttle fare off world. <laughs> Conrad, do you have any actual combat training? I'm saving the galaxy, Shepard. I don't have time for training. Don't you get it? You are a big jerk. But you saved the galaxy and showed other races that humans mattered. And then you died. <coughs> and then you the died. He needed someone like you, Shepard. We all did. I had to do something. Okay. So you just wander the galaxy righting wrongs? Hey, don't say it like that. I talk to people, you know? Ask them if they have big problems that only I can solve. You'd be surprised how many people are just waiting for someone to talk to them. Sometimes I poke through crates too, you know, for extra credits. <laughs> what the fuck? Is that ever the faith adventurer? Was im Weg? Ever dieser? Ja, ich werde jetzt der neue Shepard. Und dann macht er einfach so random quest, weil irgendjemand rumheult. Weil ihm sein Eis runtergefallen ist. Ah, ich möchte ein neues. Kauf mir bitte noch mal eins. Ich gebe dir auch das Doppelte dafür. <lacht> Any decent security system will detect that you aren't in the military, much less part of my squad. I just say that I'm deep cover and don't appear on systems. I'm doing the best I can, okay? You were a hero. You saved the galaxy and showed everyone what humanity could do. And then you died. The galaxy needed someone like you. Ja, hat er doch gerade schon gesagt. All did. I had to do something. Why were you trying to get the deed to this place? 
This place is actually a front for a red sand dealer. I need to take it over to crack the ring. What? Who the hell told you that? The owner of that weapons store near the carport? She's an undercover cop. She told me about it when I introduced myself. Listen, crap for brains. First, we don't sell red sand. Second, red sand is legal on Ilium. You just need a license. I'll talk to this undercover cop and figure out what's going on. Kommt der nur verarscht? If I kill annoying customers, it usually causes property damage. That comes out of my pay. Just let me know if you need any help, Shepard. <laughs> oh man. 200 Burner. So then he says, oh, it's okay. Our amino acids are all different. So it's not like we can get diseases or anything if we go natural. I'm telling you, this is why you shouldn't date humans. So then I had to explain about cross species fluid contact. Completely killed the mood. Not to mention that you're a quarian. How could he be so insensitive? Okay. Excuse me, I'm waiting for someone. My father was a frogan. This is the best you have, I'll make do. But you're certain that you're not going to be able to do that. I'm going to go to the technology. Area front. I think that's why you're the waffle handler. Then I'm going to go to the waffle Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I'll make it simple. Either you pay me, or I flay you alive. With my mind. Shepard! Nixeris, hold my calls. Shepard. My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. Das sind ernste Drohungen. It's good to see you too, Liara. How are you doing? I'm doing well. I've been working as an information broker. It's paid the bills since you... Well, for the past two years. And now you're back. Gunning for the collectors with Cerberus. That's not exactly public knowledge. Neither is you being alive, Shepard. Information is my business now, and if you need information on finding people, I'm happy to help. With Thane. What about you, Liara? I could use your help on this mission. I can't, Shepard. I'm sorry. I have commitments here, things I need to take care of. Uh, then give me info. Hilfe. What kind of things do you need to take care of? Are you in trouble? No, no trouble. But it's been a long two years. I had things to do while you were gone. I have debts to repay. Listen, if you want to help, I need someone with hacking expertise. Someone I can trust. If you could disable security at key points around Ilium, you could get me information I need. That would help me a great deal. Okay. If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. You can download data from there, if you hurry. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. I'm looking for Thane Krios. He's supposed to be here on Ilium. The assassin? Yes. He arrived here a few days ago. My sources tell me he may be targeting a corporate executive, Nisana Dantius. He contacted a woman named Serena. Serena has an office in the cargo transfer levels. Perhaps she can tell you where Krios is. There's an Asari named Samara here on Ilium. Do you know where I could find her? Samara? Yes. She arrived recently and registered with tracking officer Dara. You can find Dara at the transportation hub. 
Why would Samara have to register with a tracking officer? Is she a criminal? No. In fact, she's quite the opposite. Samara is a Justicar, one of an ancient sect of Asari warriors. Dara can tell you more. Yeah. Thanks for the help. That's all I needed to know. Of course. If there's anything else I can help you with, let me know. I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hints as to the location and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Who's Farron? He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the Collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. Farron sacrificed himself to save me. So you rescued me. Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. Danke für die Mitteilung. Sie haben mich gerettet. You kept me out of the collector's hands. Without you, I couldn't have come back. Thank you. I didn't know how you'd feel when Cerberus restored you. If you'd feel betrayed or they brought you back. And now they're giving me a chance to find Farron. After two years, I hadn't even dreamed. Sounds like you and Farron were close. It's funny. He betrayed me more than once. He was double dealing for Cerberus, for the Shadow Broker. But in the end, he sacrificed himself for me. I owe him. You hold Farron to look. What's the next step? I. I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard. Okay, dann gehe ich jetzt aber noch zur Waffenhändlerin. Can I help you with something? I talked to an old friend, Conrad Werner. You told him that the Eternity Lounge was selling red sand. Oh, you're Conrad's friend. Yes, that place is really dangerous. I should know. I'm an undercover cop. Did you get me the deed to the bar? I need the deed to uh stop the red sand dealers. Pay attention, lady. Unlike Conrad, I actually know how to use a gun. Wait, 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 wait! This whole place is under video surveillance! You can't shoot me! I don't give a vorch's ass about your security cameras. <laughs> Conrad Werner is an idiot, but he doesn't deserve to be manipulated like that. You're gonna make it up to him. Okay, I'll go tell him the truth. No. You're gonna tell Conrad that he did a great job, and then you're gonna leave. That's all. Are we clear? Yes, we're clear. Look, I I'm even putting you in for a discount at the kiosk, okay? I'll do that. Talk to Werner and I'm gone, I swear. Oh, okay. Yeah. Kann ich mir jetzt irgendwas davon leisten? Schon gewehr schaden, okay. Now what's this? Jetzt ist da, uh, ähm... Um, Shepard da übelst broke. I'm ich telling kann you, relax. Vax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in because it's a crime scene. I don't know. That still sounds like an awful thing to yeah. legalize. All the dangers are right there on the package. Dann gehen wir wieder zurück zu Conrad. Conrad. The weapons merchant said that we took care of the red sand dealers. I guess I really helped. This was a dangerous operation, Conrad. You could have been killed. I'd feel terrible if anything happened to you. I didn't know. I I can't risk you being worried about my safety. I'll stop pretending to be something I'm not. But thanks for letting me help, at least for a little while. It's really good to have you back. Und ich dachte schon, er wäre jetzt eigentlich so ein krasser ähm 
M7 äh, Militärdude. Aber der wird ja nicht mal durch N N1 kommen. Warum sollte er <lacht> wie dann durch N7 kommen? Oh man, der wird wahrscheinlich nicht mal die Grundausbildung schaffen, der war der Dude. Oh. Ja, mit Conrad. Er meint es eigentlich bloß gut. Aber dann gucke ich mal. Ich bin in der Handelsebene Normen, die Überwachungsbüro, praktisch dann. Dass ich dann von da aus irgendwo anders mal hinkomme. Aber das machen wir in der nächsten Folge.